Testicular cancer is the most common cancer in men aged between 15 and 44 years. In the UK, 2,000 men are diagnosed every year, with around half of these cases occurring in men under the age of 35. Stuart Coe was just 34 when he noticed a worrying change. The left testicle started feeling uh, a little firmer than the right one. Um, it started getting slightly larger, but um, not so much so that, that I thought there was anything seriously wrong. This had been going on for at least a year, and not too long after that um, was when I saw the programme. There was someone who, who had testicular cancer, and some of the symptoms that were talked about at the time um, were what sort of mentally I was ticking off in my mind. The only way I can put it in layman's terms is one felt like an unripe plum and one felt like a pretty ripe plum. I decided, you know, as a matter of urgency, I need to go and get this checked out. But when I was first told it might be testicular cancer, my thoughts were, this is serious, you yeah, this, know, this could kill me, yeah. Stuart had his testicle removed and replaced with a prosthetic one. It's now a year on and so far he seems to be clear of the disease. It's still an ongoing process, my wife and I are becoming more and more optimistic as the, the weeks and months go by. So far, you know, everything's clear. Testicular cancer is 99% curable if it's caught in the early stages. So if you have any worries, don't be embarrassed and make an appointment to see your doctor.